Welcome back to another Motorsport Uncut video. Now, this was the time of year when the motorsport season was going to start getting up and running. Obviously, the end of March, start of April is generally when racing gets going, but of course, due to the current worldwide situation, that isn't going to be happening for quite a while at least, but definitely understandable and definitely the right way about to go about it. We don't want to be racing under very uncertain circumstances, so it's good, I think, to, to wait until everyone's safe and everyone's sort of getting over this, and then we'll go racing once it is safe to do so. Um, but nonetheless, it's given a lot more time on everyone's hand that was going to go racing. Um, I've still got quite a lot I need to do to the car. I need to uh, fit in a second seat for passengers and sort of for people to help tutor me at the start of the year, um, and that's one of the things also fit the belts and and so on and also I need to get my towing license once everything reopens and get a tow bar once people are able to do so so everything is getting delayed slightly because or quite significantly because of the uh, the worldwide situation but of course I'm, I'm not complaining I completely understand why everything is going on like it is and uh, yeah I guess it's just given me a bit more time to, to make other stuff so we'll you know I've, sp I've spoken about that in a video already about what's going to be going on with the the channel but we'll speak about uh, what's going on with me and racing a little bit in this one here today. So something that I wanted to do for 2020 was sort of get a bit more custom with the car. So of course having my own car means that I can actually put a sort of a livery on it and also this as well. It's, it's quite bland. I mean the visor is quite cool that's for sure but it's not not the most interesting in the world so we've got some you know creative people out there we know that and we've got quite a long time until we go racing so i thought maybe i'll just put this out here see whether anyone can come up with some ideas here for the helmet and for the car livery so for the car livery of course the car is mainly black my idea is that it will probably stay mainly black but probably have some white and light blue accents um, so you've probably noticed over the years light blue has been a color that's sort of been featured on the channel quite a bit it's just because it's been one of my favorite colors for a long time and also the color of my first car and a color of a lot of things basically that i've owned is that sort of light blue baby blue color so maybe we can continue that on but yeah the car is black it will stay mainly black because if i'm going to do like little accents myself with some some wrap I, I don't want it to be too complicated so so yeah, I think there's some more creativity here. So I'll leave some sort of stuff in the description that can sort of give you the, the dimensions here. But this is a Bell Sport 5 helmet. I think it's still the current generation and the car's obviously a Honda Civic Type R EP3. Um, but for this we can go a little bit more creative uh, because I won't be the one painting this. So it's, it's probably more likely that you guys can put something more interesting out there for this one because I'm not going to be the one that's going to be doing all the detailing. So yeah, I'd like for this to maybe my idea in my head is that then the main color is sort of that light blue uh, but also including some white as well now i know there are lots of creative people out there so if you do have some time on your hands i wanted to design something for me that'd be really appreciated and we'll work something out about um how i say thank you so just just let me know i mean say you send me a design on uh, instagram email facebook Twitter let me know what you'd want in return for it whether that be sort of free tickets for a race event you know, money or whatever just let me know and um, that'd be interesting to see because uh, I want to give something back that you actually want not just something generic so yeah it's really tailored to whoever uh, wins I guess but yeah get those designs sent in as I said we've probably got two maybe even three months until we go racing so there's not really much pressure or time pressure here so really yeah have a bit of fun say go a bit more crazy with the helmet because i won't be the one doing that for the car try and keep it a little bit more simple and i think one of my thoughts was that i'd really like to sort of do a bit of a patreon because obviously motorsport is expensive i mean it doesn't quite help that we're going through tough times like we are right now but i was thinking maybe we can do something where you get like a passenger ride and your name on the car for a donation of some sort and i'd like to include those names on the car within the design so one of my thoughts was maybe having two stripes down the middle of the car incorporating people's names into that that was just maybe a thought i had will that all work or not you can maybe let me know as the design expert but uh, nonetheless that's sort of the main thing i wanted to, to speak about in this video obviously not too much going on in the motorsport world right now so i'm going to be focusing a lot more on the other side of my youtube channel which i sort of stopped back in sort of 2017 but we're going to get back to that a little bit more now because of what quite a lot of time on my hands because i haven't got any sort of work to be doing um, per se so i'm going to really yeah be sort of spending a lot of time here on our youtube so yeah looking forward to that and as i mentioned we've still got a bit of uh 
you know we've still got some stuff to do with the car so yeah i'm not particularly mechanically minded so it's maybe something that i'd like to mention in this video as well is throughout the 2020 season however long that may be i would actually quite like some help with uh, my car like running it sort of mechanics knowledge now it's not 100 percent confirmed whether or how it will work right now but you know i've got a couple of people interested that have mechanical knowledge of some sorts but if you have specific mechanical knowledge for the honda civic ep3 uh, type r and you'd like to work me on this project and of course it'd be a paid sort of thing uh, let me know because i'd be definitely appreciative of some help of someone that really really knows the car and understands how to, to work around it so yeah maybe maybe just send me an email there and uh, maybe we can get you involved with this year i as I said, I have no idea when we're going to get racing again. No, no, nothing's been passed on to any motorsport person right now. But you know, you see people in the US, they look to get racing in June. I think that's quite optimistic considering, yeah, considering the situation and where they're at in that stage of it. I think likely we'll probably get racing in maybe July or August at first, but uh, then budgets need to come together obviously because obviously not not working so the budgets need to come together to to make sure that i get racing at some point this year and hopefully maybe a few sponsors come back but we'll see obviously we, we don't know at this stage but yeah i'll uh, hopefully get everything together and hopefully we can go racing um later on this year i've just got to make sure that everything lines up it was all pretty much in place and, and then unfortunately the, the current worldwide situation happened and yeah everything kind of fell apart in that regard so i I'll, I'll release a video at some point sort of going through the the racing series i was going to be racing in uh but that might change obviously now going into a very uncertain future but nonetheless hopefully you enjoyed this video hopefully you can get involved with me and help me uh, design um a nice little sort of design for that um the helmet and then also maybe a simpler design for the livery that'd be massively appreciated and uh, once again thank you for tuning in and i apologize that these videos maybe weren't quite as creative as i wanted them to be because i had some really great ideas to start off this year and you know produce something totally unique and then unfortunately the situation happened um and then we've just gotta we've gotta hang it out and wait out but um, nonetheless stay safe everyone thank you so much for watching i hope you're all doing well and uh yeah my thoughts go out to everyone involved with this right now so thanks for watching it's been alex and i'm out of here goodbye